Hi everyone. Uh, in this video, we will discuss about how to identify settlements on a topographical map using symbols and patterns. First, let us discuss about the meaning of settlement. A settlement is a place where people live within a geographical area. It can vary in size, ranging from as small as a single house to a big city. This pattern depends on physical factors like terrain, water availability and climate as well as human factors like transport and economy. There are mainly three types of settlements. Uh, first one is nucleated, second one dispersed which is also called as scattered and third one is linear settlement or stite settlements. First one is nucleated or clustered settlements. In these settlements, houses and buildings are grouped closely together, often forming a village or town center. These are common in fertile areas where resources like water, transportation and fertile land are available. Another settlement on the topographical map is the best example for nucleated settlement where we can see all the houses or buildings are grouped closely together. So it shows the best example for nucleated settlement. Second one dispersed or scattered settlement. In these settlements houses are spread out over a large area with significant distances between them. This type of settlements are found in areas with rough terrain or poor soil conditions etc. This type of settlements are mainly found in hilly areas, forest, deserts or regions with extreme climate. The settlements which you can see on the topographical map or the best example for dispersed are scattered settlements. So here the settlements are scattered, they scattered away from each other. So these are best example for scattered settlement or dispersed settlement. Third one, linear settlements. These settlements develop along a line such as a river, road or coastline. The settlements follow the directions of the transport or water resource, mainly found near roads or rivers. On topo map, here you can see the settlements are located near water bodies in a straight line. So these are best example for linear settlements. Here also you can see the settlements are located near roads in a straight line. So this is also best example for linear settlements. Let us know in the comments which pattern you see in this grid square. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe for more amazing geographical content. Thank you.